Yo, in this video, I wanted to explain how the camera system works in my asset, the dialog component. In the demo level, I have several examples already built out, and looking at the cube's dialog component, NPC Extras dropdown, we can see the eyedropper and a camera actor that's already selected. It's relatively simple. Whatever camera you select, it'll get used in that branch. One important thing though, you need to have this use NPC camera variable set to true for that branch or in the global settings. So if it's off here, but the global settings are on, it'll get used. If we turn it on in the branch, but off in global, it'll get used. Turning it off in both will use the player's default camera and not switch to the NPC's camera at all. It goes without saying that the way I've set it up is so that you can switch between cameras very easily. Like in the camera change example, it starts off using the default NPC camera, then switches and switches again. You can also simply add a camera shake component to the camera, assign the shake, and it'll get used and stop when the branch switches. I hope that provides clarity on how to use this feature. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.